All right. In this episode, we are reclaiming the wilderness. So we're going to head to the ancient spire in Revelwood. So let's hit F. There it is. We are going to go to our mining altar right here. As I'd stated earlier, we're going to run along the side. We're going to find a bridge to cross over and start heading that direction. So let's get started. First, as always, check our bags. We have a backup altar in place. And here we go. So the now if you don't have an altar up this way already as a forward base, basically you'll go from Springlands. It's best to go this way. You'll head towards where the uh, farmer is. Uh, get on the other side of the ancient vault here where the farmer was, and then just head up to this point. Whether you drop yourself an altar or not, this just happens to be my favorite mining point and uh, a, a forward base, if you will, or altar. All right, so we are going to start heading that direction, grab as much flax as possible, because we're gonna start planting flax and farming flax for linen. So when we get the spindle, uh, we're ready to go. We're ready to uh, make a lot of linen to advance ourselves. All right, so again, we're staying to the right of the shrouded area here. Uh, we'll fly down past this fun stuff. Uh, good mining point there, but I like mine better. A little higher up. And here we go. This is the bridge we're going to. And we're going to cross here. So let's get ready for that. But I have to get... Oh, dang it. Oh, it didn't get me. Oh, it didn't get me. Just keep moving around, except I am out of... Uh, stamina. That's not a good deal. But as long as you keep moving clockwise or counterclockwise around them, uh, you can most often uh, dodge those poison balls nailing you in the face. Those face huggers. <laughs> All right, so we're, let's get started here. We're going to cross over, so get up here. Hopefully I can lure... No, I guess I'm not going to get lucky. Get this guy with ice. Get the dog with... Oh, there's a little level. I forgot about that. Hey, wee, 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 wee. I'll let you get close. What's up with that? The heck are you going? Huh. There we go. And... Head up. Uh, let's chew on a little bear for health regen. Uh, this track's not going to work for me. This track. Tra trap. There, did I get it? I'm going to find out the hard way. Bombs, good to know. All right. Hmm. Good. Good, dogs. Stronger wands. Mm. Mm. Well, at least I got the doggy. <clears throat> bones, 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 bones. What are you, a doggy? Uh, you're a doggy. Nice. Okay. Okay. Try using uh, ice wall. Yeah, ice staff spells at a distance. <clears throat> and I'm not using that uh, 
Let's see, I'm not going to the shroud here. Let me drink one of these. Get my damage up. All right. This next one's kind of fun because there are bar exploding barrels. See that? It's those barrels and you're near them. That's why he's here. Just to make life miserable. All right, very good. Uh, right. So you can't go off to the left here. There's a cave. I'm just going for the strawberries myself. Um, there's a cave here with a loose, a, a luminescent, you know, materials to make a luminescent blocks. There's spiders in here. Not interested right now, so we are headed to Revelwood Spire. So just hug the cliffside here till we get to the enshrouded area. Then we're gonna go through the shroud a little bit and uh, come up around where the entrance is to the ancient spire. So keep going, keep going, looting along the way. <clears throat> Loot, loot. Oop, more, 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 more. Pick up everything uh, that you can without wasting too much time. All right, so these run, run away from you. Uh, the red ones don't. They aggro on you. Uh, those things are pretty good to kill for poison sacks. Um, you get more off those than you do the flowers. But at some point, you're gonna need poison sack, so. Now you know. Now I can remember. Because it's been long. All right, here's the shrouded area. We're gonna go through it. Essentially, let's make sure there's nothing gonna jump me. All right, um, we're going up around, and then we're gonna come up uh, probably right in here. And then we're going to upset an altar probably right over here to the left of the ancient shrine. <clears throat> All right, so here we go. All right, see, already starting to come up out of these shrouds. See, that was a short stint. And then up and around. And there's some uh, hogs here. Uh, Try to stay away from them. Basically, run up here, trigger the. Ooh, is it stuck? Ooh, no, it's not. Level six, very nice. So we haven't even used our points from our previous level. So let's go H. Now we have four points. We're gonna put two in the runner so that we're able to uh, increase stamina consumption, a decrease by 10%. So sprint speed increased by 10%, stamina consumption during sprinting decreased by 10%. Right, now I have two points left and I'm gonna save them up because double jump costs four and we'll get there soon enough, all right? So here we are, this is our return beacon. I'm going to head down Right over this way, and uh, this way, and this way. And if there's no hogs around or enemies, I should be able to set this altar right here. See, can't build, can't build here, but I can build right here. And that's good enough. All right, so I'm gonna go back to base, clear my bags, repair and uh, get ready to climb the spire. Revelwood, very nice. I'll see you back here in a moment. All right, I am back and let's get rolling upstairs, up the tower. Right. So here we go, up, 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 up. And I'm going to try not to spend time breaking uh, 
these canisters. I'm going to try. But sometimes you have to. All right, we have two switches we have to find right there, all right? So we go around, we can check the doors. That's locked. This one's not locked. Uh, this one's not locked, all right? So we are going to head this way first. Uh, let's see here. Boom, boom. Gosh, I wish I had. Uh... So we're going to follow these to the left. And uh, I ran, I, I sprinted and I ran into that. See how much damage that did? Wow, that hurt. That hurt a lot. I need to make more bandages. I have three left. Um, let's go ahead and regen. All right, we're going to hit the button because I can't. I gotta be full health, I can't take a hit. So you just go in and just jump, all right? And then for these, you know the drill. So time it, jump, double jump would be nicer. And there we go. So button one, now we go over here and we're gonna run through this one. This one's a little bit different. The fact that you're just following the middle one, you could hang it right there and uh, you know loot those chests but we're gonna hit this button button number two and gosh i really want to break this stuff you get some really good loot resources and so on but i want this uh, video to go fast i can come back and loot this all right so uh, dark places i always want to make sure i'm looking around nothing out here and uh, we're gonna head up up to the next level All right, and then we come here. Now we have four switches. So the first one, and I wanna equip my bow for this one. First switch is right here. Not that it's first switch, but one of the switches is there. There's one, and then get over there, the other switch, just lean a little bit to the right of the wall, and there's switch number two, all right? So what we're gonna do now is we're gonna go to the right, all right? So, um, quit talking and pay attention. Just sprint across these, the timing, right? Uh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Uh, jump. I went the wrong way. We're going this way to the left, and up this. Stamina, of course, while you're climbing the great ladder, whatever you want to call it. Right, we're going to jump across uh, here. So jump, jump would be so nice. I can't wait to get it. And we're gonna do it again. So jump, boom, silver chest. So staff, 1329. Believe that's an upgrade. Nothing out here of importance. So you can see this switch from here, but you can also, that's button number three. You can also hit it, uh, from the other side, right? So let's see here. I wanna go back down. Um, this is where we came in, so three, right? And now we're gonna to run to the left. So run, 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 sprint. Uh, up, up, jump, there we go, right? And then, why am I, up, oh, there we go. It's like going, I'm missing something. So here's button four. Right, so the point I was making was if you come over here, you can hit that button, right? Or, or over by the silver chest. All right, so there's uh, four. Jump down. There we go. And up to the next level. All right, this one's pretty easy. Uh, there's one there. And there's one right here. All right, there we go, that's open. We go in, you can go to the right or the left. I'm going to the right. Uh, I don't remember where stuff is. Um, and I don't, I don't. All right, we're in. All right, ready? See, I wanna go look, I wanna go break stuff. So what's going on there? All right. Uh, open so right or the left we'll get here this is very important this is where a gold chest is ah. Ah. crappy whip 
crappy weapon, but it's certainly better than 720. This is a 1329. I believe that's an upgrade. Let's put these down here. We'll look at them later, right? And over here again, just nothing special. Just oh, I got it out of my system. See this? You get potions. You get all sorts of good stuff when you do that. All right, so button. Button. There we go. Going up, going up. And we're going to jump across these. So again, it's just the timing. Boom, there it is. There it is. And there we go. We're going up. And we have arrived. New location charted, and we have a Revelwood fast travel. Very nice. So from here, okay, okay, thank you. You can quiet down. All right, so from here, um, we're able to get to a lot of other different points in the map that we're gonna, for other quests that we're gonna get, uh, especially over here, Crucible, finishing up the spindle quest and all of that fun stuff so all right uh, i'm gonna wrap this session up right here and then i'm gonna go down here and get rid of this altar because i no longer need it of course and uh let's see in the next episode we're going for the saw blade i believe let's look yeah i think i want to go for the saw blade uh, really tempted to start the hand spindle quest so hmm i might yeah i think i'm going to do the hand spindle so we'll just make that one active and uh I'll, this is what we're going to do in the next episode it's a couple of uh a couple of entries you know a couple of things you have to do it's not too bad essentially you know you, you fly up as if you're going to the farmer uh, unfortunately we don't have the altar anymore so that's okay it's a quick run you come over here and you hit this book and then uh, it sends you to the next part and eventually we're going to see it start flashing up over here where we go into a cave and uh, we get the spindle so I look forward to seeing you there and until the next episode thanks very much for watching your support like and subscribe if, if you enjoy this content this is for my friends and myself these are video logs of games we play so we're gonna be, we know we're going to be back to Entrouded quite often over the next year or so. And when we do return, um, it's nice to have a log of the events to get acclimated. We know that versions, as they're coming out, new releases, are going to change stuff. But still, uh, it's good to have a base log that you can start with. So thanks again. Talk to you all later. And until then, happy gaming!